Hello and welcome to the show. My name is Chris. This will be a reaction new TV show from Marvel Secret Invasion, episode one, Resurrection. I know this is a little bit out of order from what I've watched, but this is supposed to be a direct sequel of Captain Marvel that I have watched. I'm hoping that I can get all the other shows in for Marvel Phase 4, possibly the movies, before the next show. No, I got a couple months. I won't watch the movies out of order. Hopefully it goes well. But without further ado, let's get on the show. Uh, we start in Moscow. Yes. I'll be right there. Don't move. Joker is all over the place. Wasn't he in Wakanda? The ones closest to us. The ones we've trusted our whole lives. We're someone else entirely. What if they weren't even human? Wow. Way to put that seed into someone's head. Agent Ross, these attacks are escalating. If they hit the soil of a major power. Oh. So you, you think the same people are behind all of this? Not people. Scrolls. Oh, come on, Ross. You know the stories. This didn't start yesterday. It started 30 years ago when the scrolls found Earth. All these other attacks, they will be nothing compared to this. This is the one that sets the world on fire. What the hell's that? That dude is scroll. His scroll. Oh, he got lucky. Delos. It's me. What the hell are you doing here? I'm chasing him. He was one of you. Knew it. Hey, that looks like Nick. Well, Saint Nick. Saint Nick Fury. Ravik is now the newest member of the Scroll Council. He preys on the collective rage of young, displaced scrolls. Where is his ass? He's here. He's in Russia. Scrolls are immune to radioactivity, and Russia has the most abandoned nuclear plants on Earth. But he, we brought you here for a reason. If he succeeds, um, your species will cease to exist. <laughs> Going for a walk. They are effectively a wall. Agent Fury, really? He's not even the director anymore. Damn, and I was hoping for a command performance of Old Man River. Oh, good to see you too, Sonya. So, did you just have me extraordinarily renditioned by a group of your thugs? Were you not extraordinary? Oh, you should only scratch the surface of mediocrity. You must be keeping from me all these years. It was an old English spy master that started the tradition. A clock goes up when your time in the circus is done. What do you know what? about a heist 
at a black market storage facility in Kazakhstan. It happened a couple of days ago. Doesn't ring a bell. You know, I may not know when a scrub is pretending to be a human, but I sure as hell know when a human is lying. You know damn well what was in that storage box. Take your natural form. Is that going to be his daughter? That's going to be old boy's daughter. Watch. Victory. Must be the thing they're building. Considered good looking amongst my kind, man. You know, I know a bunch of good looking bro. <laughs> you ain't. Okay, all right, guys, what is the play here? Uh, I say we visit this. Those two play off each other so Sonia well. Sonia will already have agents there. Who we will incapacitate. Hold on, stop. You talking about attacking MI6 operatives? Talos, let me explain something to you. We're no longer in just a war with Gravik. We're in a race with Sonia Fallsworth, who celebrates the scorched earth policy. Me There's something going on between those two. Hmm. Oh shit! I got it. Right, they're strong. Yeah. Not bad for a 136-year-old. Wow. Well, you know, not even 40 in human years. Haven't even gone on my midlife crisis shopping spree yet. Hey, what you get for yours? The Avengers. <laughs> this is midlife crisis. I foul about this one having a wife. Yeah, it has an ex-wife. Lives in Miami with a soccer player. Oh, so <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and call uh. that a lie. Everybody gets one. Nobody gets two. Gets one. Nobody gets two. You going to shoot me? Maybe. Well, probably. <laughs> but not right now. Ah, where are the bombs? Your name's not Keller. Yep. <laughs> Skrull, your name is Thanos. Come on. Aren't they supposed to change after they die? I said no. It seems like two of the main characters in the story already seen differing views. Ah, oh, don't do it, Maria. You really went into the labyrinth in the dark against someone that you suspect possibly to be a scroll. say but there's always another i knew that was his daughter god you didn't know her mom was dead how why did you ask the people that you work for he's gonna be the mole uh-oh 
You didn't know mama was dead. Hmm. Interesting. I haven't decided. See, that's what I'm worried about. The fury I knew was always three steps ahead. If I remember correctly, you called me. On Talos' request. Your lack of contact over the past few years sent a pretty clear message. Meaning? You're not ready for this, Fury. Okay, I'm thoroughly confused now. See me because I'm not here. I understand. You're taking a risk. A risk? Is that what you explained to Mum? That following you could get her killed? Your mother died while you were working for her killer. So do not take me down that road, Gaia. Gaia's come back. What? What? That was a really stupid scene. The little girl he saw a couple nights before. That's the guy he saw in the bar? I had a feeling they'd be bait. Came back. Really? Really? You gotta be kidding me. Yep, it's that guest star Colby Smolders because that's the last time you'll ever see her. I cannot believe they killed Maria. Oh my god. She actually might have been one of my favorite characters in all of Marvel. She didn't say a lot, but she got jobs done. She was Fury's right hand, so there goes Fury's right hand. And I don't know if Talos' daughter's back. So, well, we got some setup. So Nick Fury's doubting himself, and everyone sees it except him. You know, he kind of sees it. Talos isn't ruthless like he should be, and the other scrolls basically um turned on him and went evil, trying to take over Earth. But they're they're not super scrolls. Remember this from the comics. They don't, or like, we're not going to take any superheroes over because we couldn't afford it, right? Oh, well, so I think it was a decent first episode. I don't know. I think it jumped around too much. I tried forcing too much into one episode. It kind of felt like, you know, that for 20 minutes longer than WandaVision ones I'm watching. But hers are three more episodes, so I don't know. We'll see. Um, I thought it was all right. There were some stupid lines that I didn't agree with. Yeah, I guess we'll see where it goes without Maria because, you know, Kill her off like it, but uh, that was meh. I really did. I didn't. I don't know. I don't. I don't know how to feel about this episode yet. I guess I need to watch some more of the season, but this one just kind of felt kind of boring. Like Samuel Jackson, but you could see his age in some of this. He's moving around probably better than me and thirty years older. But you know, I mean, you can kind of see it. So yeah, I'm just kind of eh right now. I guess. See, we'll see where it goes. Um, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. If you did feel free like share subscribe comment below and thank you for watching this long until next time bye